Hi everyone, my name is Shannon and I'm with Health Team Advantage Living Plus. Today I'm going to show you a recipe using pumpkins. Now we just finished up Halloween, so if you still have your pumpkins on your porches or used for decoration, this is a perfect recipe for you. I'm going to be using the air fryer today, so if you're interested in learning how to make a recipe with pumpkin seeds in the air fryer, keep on watching. Okay, so all you're going to need for this recipe is a pumpkin. So grab whatever pumpkins you have out on your porch or for decoration. It doesn't matter the size as long as you're able to carve around and scoop out the seeds to be able to use for the recipe. So I'm going to go ahead and get carving my pumpkin and we'll be back in a second. So once you've finished carving out your pumpkin, you can see I have all the seeds here with all of the pulp too. So what you're gonna do is clean it up in a colander and we're gonna do that and transition to show how to do that next. So I have my colander here in my sink, so I'm gonna pour it all in there. Once you get the water running, it's really easy to clean off and get the pumpkin seeds separated from the other parts of this pumpkin, the stringy orange stuff. So I'm going to toss that and you can see once you just pick through it's pretty easy to get to all of the seeds. Once you have all of your seeds rinsed and in your colander you want to take a kitchen towel spread it out and pour your pumpkin seeds on the towel and get any little extra pieces you may have missed in there. But what you're going to do is spread these out and make sure that they can dry. So it's going to take about 10 minutes or so. You might want to pat them dry too, just like I'm doing here. And it might take 10 minutes or so for them to completely dry. They might be still a little slimy, but I'm just going to let them kind of air dry. So I'm back 10 minutes later after my seeds have dried, so I'm going to place these in a clean bowl and get them ready to be seasoned to be air fried. So I'm just placing these in, folding up my towel to make it a little bit faster process to get these into the bowl. But once I do that, I have my seasonings and spices ready to use. So for this recipe, I'm using just three simple ingredients olive oil, and you can use whatever you prefer here, as well as pepper and salt. So that's all you need for this recipe, but you can use whatever seasonings you prefer. If you like a salt-free version, you could use Mrs. Dash. This is a great recipe to be creative with the flavors. So, But I'm gonna go simple here with some salt and pepper. So I have a teaspoon measuring utensil here, so I'm gonna put a teaspoon of oil. Now depending on how many pumpkin seeds you're using, it will just depend on how much oil you use. You just wanna make sure it's coated pretty evenly. I'm just gonna eyeball the salt and pepper. Don't go overboard here, because you can always add more, but you can never take away. So it's a good rule of thumb. So I just start out with a little bit of each, and then put those in there. I um. Then take a spoon and mix it all so it's nice and coated and ready to be cooked in our air fryer. So I have my air fryer here. I have a Power XL air fryer. I think I got it at Target a few years ago, but any air fryer will work. And so you can see playing around with the temperatures here, but I'm just going to take my pumpkin seeds and place it straight into the basket of my air fryer, just like that. And what you're gonna do is set your air fryer for 350 degrees for 10 minutes, and then you're all set. All right, I'm back 10 minutes later. I did um, shake my air fryer halfway in between just so they can get evenly cooked, but here is the finished product. 
It looks delicious, nice and crispy, almost like I wish you could smell it, but it smells delicious. But I have this sheet pan here uh, with a silicone mat on it that I'm going to just spread these out on so that way they can cool for a little bit because you don't want to package them right when they're hot. Here's our finished product, crispy pumpkin seeds right out of the air fryer. Delicious and easy and such a great source of protein. Let us know if you try it. Thanks for watching. Bye.